Welcome back everyone, I'm Craven and this is Atelier Ryza. And now let's continue on exploring this pixie forest and let's see if we can find the source of why we are saying the forest is crying. Because if the forest is crying, we do need to help it. Because it's our new home now, we have our secret hideout in here. もう理中で気配が<笑> We are adventurers and we are protectors of everyone here, so we're gonna do this. Uh, it's big, not as big as I thought it was. Did it sense that we were so inferior compared to him that it just walked away? あ、ライザ、どうだった？クラディア、話は後だよ。早く島に戻ろう。Okay, so we're back on the island. <laughs> we basically ran because we didn't know what to do with the big monster. Somehow that feels unsatisfying. I want to protect my new home, my new hideout. Because don't tell me we cannot get to it anymore. At least not for now. It's that adoption yet. <laughs> ah, we need to protect our hideout. I want it to be our permanent residence. So, so happy. I want it back. <laughs> Alright, so. I am walking, but we could might as well just teleport to Old Town. We you know uh, they're there. Uh, 
Oh, pet! Hey you there, Riza. Oh, and who is this lovely young lady? My name is Claudia. Hmm. Then that must make you Lubert's daughter. Two of the new island's newest residents. Hmm. Hmm, I have to say, your outfit is quite exquisite. The waves and the stitchings are magnificent. Whoever made it knew how to tailor it perfectly to its owner. And the dye work on your skirt is stunning. How long have you been wearing this? Uh, I am... Um, mm. Ah, okay, Pat, that's enough. Oh, sorry about that. Old habits die hard, I guess. You have a habit of inspecting clothes? <laughs> yeah, clothes. Uh, anyway, did you always work at the dye house here at the island? Oh, no, actually, I was an apprentice in the city. Once I was ready to open my own shop, I came back here. But during my training, lovely folks like this young lady here came to see me all the time. Wow, so it must have been a pretty expensive store, eh? Hmm, now, anytime I see anything unique or unusual, I fall back into the world. I guess that's, that habit just, habit just stuck with me. If you really love clothes that much, you should reopen your shop, don't you think, Claudia? <laughs> yeah, that would be a wonderful idea. Well, I never would have closed if it if these old bones still move like they used to. If I could have taken on an apprentice, maybe things would have been differently. Hmm, an apprentice. Anyway, that's all in the past now. Ah, uh, I've talked your ears off again. <laughs> I think I'll get going. <laughs> Thanks for talking to us. Mm, I'd love it if Kirken Island had a die house again. Hmm, maybe we can find an apprentice for him. Do, do you have anyone in mind specifically? <laughs> Not at all. Mm, Pet mentioned that Claudia's outfit looked and felt just like the kind of thing he used to make when he used to run a dye shop. I asked him why he didn't reopen his business and he said it's because he doesn't have an apprentice to pass it on to. Hmm, wonder if I know anyone that might fit the bill. It would be very nice if uh, we have a place where we can learn new clothing recipes. Or buy clothes. It's not that I need to make everything myself. I just wish I could. So you work at the Sekakuno クラディアにはさっき家に帰ってもらったけど、このままだとまたあそこに行くのも難しそうで。あの広場が安全だって確認できるまで、部活に隠れ家としても使えないしな。二人ともあの魔物について何か知らない？絶対普通じゃない感じ
遭遇した場所は商用性の森なのは間違いないんだなあ,あアトリエからそこそこ離れた場所だった逃げた方向も全然違うと思うなるほどしかし奴らはどこから来た石膏が遠出をするとも思えん北側のあそこかしかしあれは奴らと戦う側のはずなあリラああ構わんぞすまんが今すぐ隠れ家に案内してくれないかいいけどいずれ二人にもお披露目するつもりだったしよしでは行こうやつらへの対処はできるだけ早い方がいいそれが何を教えてくれたのか、何を教えてくれたのか、何を教えてくれたのか、何を教えてくれたのか、何を教えてくれたのか、何を教えてくれたのか、何を教えてくれたのか、何を教えてくれたのか、何を教えてくれたのか、何を教えてくれたのか、何を教えてくれたのか、承知で頼むがこの隠れ家に私とリラを見張りとして住まわせてくれないかアンペルさんたちをアトリエの見張りに俺たちにとっちゃ願ったりかなったりだけどよ島の方の家はどうするんだ村での暮らしにこだわりはない引き払うだけさもともと私たちは旅ガラスだからなそれに、奴らや遺跡を調査するにも、対岸のここに本拠地があった方が便利だ。その、奴らのことはすまんが、もう少し状況をつかむまで待ってくれ。迂闊に話せることではなくてな。わかった。でも、万が一の対処の仕方は教えといてくれよ。当然だ。生還は喜ばしいとして無謀のツケはしっかり体に叩き込んで<笑>後の戒めとしなければなうえそうだクラウディアにも話さなきゃクラウディアんちにも行ってみよう<笑>メインランドデスティネーション has changed What does that mean? You no longer need to go to the Traveler's Road. You must now head to the hidden clearing in Pixie Forest. Was that our current object? Wait. Do I see a green? I think we have. I think we have what we wanted. We are using the dock right now. We are. That's perfect. Next part of my plan make a bigger ship. Alright, let's、uh, talk to everyone. And then we're gonna have a short little visit with Claudia. First of all, we need to check and see if there are any monsters in the area, so stay alert. Same place, same text. Maybe we should also go inside? I want to see what this is actually. <laughs> Nothing yet. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is gonna be a teleport board.、Uh, I just know it.
I was thinking, we should try and make better use of our time while we're crossing the lake. That, that's a surprisingly responsible thing to hear. Coming from you. What's that supposed to mean? I'm always responsible. <laughs> so, what do you have in mind? Well, I was thinking we could do a little fishing. I'm actually pretty good at it. Yeah, too good. You always end up pulling up those huge freaking fish, so please don't. Mm, I'm going to take that as a compliment, but I see what you mean. Okay, never mind. Oh, you, you gotta love those small benters of them. Alright, let's go straight over to Claudia's. Or do we want to... No, it's night time, so might as well just go straight uh, to her place. Is it Old Town or is it Bowden? I think it is Old Town. Yep, there it is. If it was during the day, I would probably have uh, visited the other areas as well. But we've already seen that if we want the quest, we need to go there during the day. At night, not so much. Yeah, just uh, having a look see if I'm not uh, mistaking myself. Because there is a ghost girl at the uh, upper clearing. Which is not actually, actually a ghost girl. It's more like someone who has a skin condition that she cannot see in the sunlight. But the entirety of town sees her as a ghost girl. I can imagine that at some point in the story we're going to have a quest from her. Just trying to help her maybe get uh, something to help her go into the day. We'll see. Irasai, Raisa. Nandaka, Taihena Kotoni not Chapane. Atoria no Hua, Arekara Donatano. Dira Santa Chiba Mawario Shiraberte. Atasimo Doroitao. And now Soroshi Mamono Hajimete Mitakoraso.近くにいないっていうかかれば私もアトリエに出入りする許可がもらえるかな実際にあいつを見てないとはいえ度胸はあるな顔にも見習わせたいくらいだよこう見えてもお父さんといろんなところを旅したからねと yeah, he's going right at it in the only way he knows how. Knowledge. えぇ。でも、タオ君の方よりもまず村の人たちがその魔物について知ってるんじゃあんな魔物がいるなんて一度も聞いたことないよ。多分村の誰も知らないんじゃないかな。そんなに恐ろしい魔物なら伝説とかいくらでも残ってそうなのに島の外にはあるかもしれないけど私たちは先祖代々何百年も島の中だけで暮らしてるからね何百年クリント王国があった頃からずっと島暮らしなんだそう
悪今度の魔物と出くわすことだってあるんだよアトリエを作る時こっそり島の外に連れ出してたのもほとんど反則というか起きて破りみたいなもんでお願いもうその顔はずるいって<笑>しょうがないな分かったよ本当無理だと思うけどお父さんの許可が取れたらね無理だと思うけど<laughs> I don't think her father will allow it and somewhere I also think Claudia is not going to ask well at least until she has enough courage <laughs> she thinks I can convince him of everything. Just give me a little bit of time, so one day? <laughs> Damn, if, if you can convince your father for letting you into a dangerous situation without any noticeable protection but land, I wouldn't know how you would try to f uh, work that out. I would be happy if you do. Okay, I think that's still the same text. <laughs> and that's definitely the same text. Alright, so she wants to see us tomorrow, so I guess going back to her room and just uh, going in for the night. Eh, no, no. Right, let's sleep into morning, and if there are no scenes, uh, we might as well go to her house through a couple of other regions just to see if there are any new quests. Hey, we've got a couch. Did we always have a couch before the pot? Can't remember, to be honest, it's been so many episodes. Uh, maybe you guys can tell me. Or I can watch my own episodes first, but... Nah, you guys can tell me. Alright, let's go. It's first here. Hmm, nothing? That shouldn't take too long. Now that we know how to work our maps. Yeah, still the open quest for the seeds. Okay, we got a doctor's request and a scene. Yahoo! Hello, Fresher. Yeah. Welcome. We've got rare things on sale, stranger. Uh, sorry, just a little joke. Mm -hmm. Tao. What are you doing here? Well, Fresher needed to make a quick delivery, so he asked me to keep an eye out on the shop for a bit. <sighs> wow, you're running the shop all by yourself? Are you sure you can handle it? No, How no. dare you? I've already assisted several customers, as a matter of fact. I've memorized where all the products are, and they have all the prices here in Fresher's accounting ledger. Why don't you buy something for yourself? Hmm. <laughs> Look at you, acting like a real shop owner. I'm back. Sora's gone for so long. Oh, hi Reza. Hey Fraser, welcome back. Did you have any customers while I was gone? I hope you didn't have any trouble. <laughs> You're starting to sound like Reza. What do you people fake me for? <laughs> okay, okay, my bad. I wasn't sure if you'd be able to handle this kind of thing. Yeah, same here. Jeez. I know you know I've entered every single sale I made today. <laughs> wow. It, 
It's already organized. He did have quite a few customers. Not bad. Not bad at all. Well, you are the smartest friend I have. I guess I shouldn't be too surprised. Maybe I'll ask you to help me out again. Then I could expand my business and... Ooh, so, so, sorry. I have to refuse. That would cut into my reading time. <laughs> Sounds like you're pretty firm on that. Yeah. His passion is getting knowledge from all his books and he cannot stop until he read all of them, so... We understand. We know him. We've been following him since the beginning of this game, so... Okay, Fresher, let's see if you have anything new. I doubt it, but I always want to check. Yeah, nothing new. The only new thing is, our money is getting higher and higher every day. Alright, let's uh, go and see the doctor. Let's see what kind of medicine we can get for him. Ooh, not, a, not allowed. Mm, I wonder if there's any way I would force myself to remember everything. Uh, let's see. Complete the quest delivering sound and have one day passed. Alright, so is that a quest we already have or? No, so we first need to have that quest and completed it and then have spent the night uh, at the house. Oh, that's fine, it's fine. We can get it done. Hey, it's the die guy. Bad. Hey, Reza. You're doing good today. Of course. How about you? Same as ever. I just been doing some farm work and decided to take a little break. You know, it used to be people would pass by here all the time and chat. But it seems like there's less and less people every day. So I'm glad you can make it and stop some uh, a little bit to uh, have some time to talk to me. Oh, hey Reza and Pat. <laughs> now this is a rare combination. Oh, hi there Rolf. You're on business? Yep. Just doing my daily water deliveries. Just a few more left and then I'm free. <laughs> Boy, you haven't changed at all. <laughs> anyway, if you got any odd jobs that need doing, just let me know. Jobs, hmm. Oh! I know of one good job. Oh, yeah? <laughs> you might help Pet out with his die house. What? Pet said he'd be able to reopen his die house if he had an apprentice to help out. Oh, oh, no, no, no. That's over and done with. Even if I took on an apprentice now. Dying, huh? Hmm. That sounds pretty cool. Sure, I'll give it a shot. No, 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 really, really, really. I gave it up a long time ago. All my equipment is rusted out. Oh, I'm sure I can fix that. Come on, let me take a look at it. You got some time now? Mm, well, uh, but... <laughs> I don't know the first thing about dying, but I grew up wearing the clothes you made. Come on, just let me take a little peek. Please, let me into your house. Uh-oh. I'm getting red flags here. I think Rolf is gonna... I'm not gonna think he's gonna murder him, but he might steal all his clothes. No, just hold on. <laughs> you can see Pet like, oh my god, what have I gotten myself into? I should have never talked to Ryza. <laughs> uh, I'm looking forward to your new clothing line. <laughs> I really hope he's gonna open his die house again. Wait, wait, Rolf, what about your other customers? Hmm. 
While talking with Pet, I was reminded of Rolf, who had been working as a local handyman. I asked Rolf if he'd be interested in becoming an apprentice, and he said he was. I feel like this could be a match made in heaven. Well, if you're gonna give me money just by talking to people, I say it's a match too. Well, we might have gotten to this place as last, because we need to be here for Claudia. Well, let's go to the other two places as well. Maybe one day we'll get a quest here at Trevon Hill. But we all know it's not gonna happen. <laughs> They're too rich to uh, ask something for us. And I think we also got a quest here that we couldn't get yet. Yeah, it's the quest of the dog. Because if I remember correctly, we needed an. Uh, war powder? Yeah, that was the one that we couldn't make yet. So let's go back to Old Town then. I wonder if we go to the old place of Ample and Lila. We, we cannot even get into the house anymore. Looks like this house is abandoned too. We can get into this house? A classroom? I believe we never tried this, so let's get in here and let's see what this classroom is all about. It is an actual classroom with quests. <gasps> Alright. I think we're gonna be schooled here, but that is something we're gonna do on next episode, so. I hope you all be there as we are gonna try to see if we can teach Raisa something so she comes over a little bit more educated, a little bit less dense. But that's gonna be next time. And it's gonna, and it is, of course, also helps us remind us if there are doors we might be able to enter, we need to do it. I'm, I'm very surprised that I didn't notice this before, but we're gonna continue with this on next episode. Until then, I wish you all a great night, morning, day, wherever you are. Till next time. Bye-bye.